of logical calculus. I cannot read another word. I'm so bored. Nothing ever happens to poor Alice, stuck out here in this horrible place. With that, for company, why I... Oh, oh dear, oh dear, I'm late. I'm very late. A talking rabbit wearing a waistcoat and a pocket watch? It's getting. Oh, Mr. Rabbit, wait! Now, where could he be? Now, that wasn't there before. Catch that rabbit. Too small. Who needs rabbits?
to the beautiful garden. If I get larger, I can reach the key. And if I get smaller, I can crawl under the door. The Duchess. Oh, won't she be savage if I've kept her waiting? Savage! Mm. Uh, if you please, sir. Have you... Ah! A giant! Wait, wait, Mr. Rabbit. You've dropped your gloves. into the beautiful garden. Oh no, not again. Maybe I can break the door down. Oops! It's salty. It doesn't seem like the ocean. I know, it's my tears. I better not drown. That would just be too silly. Drowning in your own tears. I do wish I hadn't cried so much when I was big. Help! Help! Over here! The 
good day, Mr. Mouse. Good day? I've never had a worse one. Walking about, minding my own business when splash, in I went. You don't, perchance, know where the shore is, I suppose? No, I do not. That way, uh, I hope. Excuse me, Mr. Mouse. That is a most unusual swimming stroke. It's called the Mouse Paddle. I invented it myself. Really? You may try it, if you wish. Thank you. But I do believe my tail would not be long enough. Hmm. Perhaps you're right. I wonder who is responsible for letting the sea in here. Actually, I don't think it's the sea at all. You see, I was crying. Why, well, if, if I get my paws on whoever did it, I'll, I'll, I'll nibble their nose off. Now, uh, what were you saying about crying? Oh, nothing. Look, there's the shore. Lizard. Oh, I'm getting too old for swimming in the sea. It's not the sea. What do you mean? Not the sea? Oh, um, nothing. Oh, me. How will I ever dry myself? I don't have to worry about that. As they say, water off a duck's back. Not water off a lizard's back. Huh. Lizards should not swim in the sea. It's not the sea. Oh, never mind. Oh, I'm so wet. How will I ever get dry? We'll all dry up by having a rain. Who are you? A dodo, of course. Come on, let's have a rain. But dodos are ext... Yes? Uh, it's just that I thought dodos were. Well, they're not, are they? Because <laughs> I'm here, aren't I? You most certainly are. Right. Let's run. You stand here. And you stand here. You over there. But I'm not wet. I don't want to race. Oh, do be quiet. <laughs> Ready, ready, go! This really is the most uh, unusual race. Uh, perhaps, but it's a very good way to get dry. It's called a caucus race. How do you know who's winning? You don't. How do you know when it's finished? You don't. <laughs> Isn't it fun? Come on. Faster. Faster. Oh, oh dear. Oh, I'm too old for this. Excuse me, Mr. Dodo. Do you know the way into that most beautiful garden on the other side of the sea? Garden? Garden? How would I know anything about garden? I'm a... <laughs> you, you, you there. Where are my white gloves? Oh, I'm afraid I left them out there. You left them out there? Oh, here, fetch me another pair of gloves from my house. But... That way, quickly. Such a silly girl. Oh, yes, a complete dodo. <laughs>
doesn't say drink me, but something interesting is bound to happen. Mm, delicious. Perhaps I'll grow larger. Perhaps I should have waited until I was outside. <laughs> shoes and you can take them back if they're a bit tight. This house is definitely a few sizes too small for me. Young lady, young lady, where are my gloves? Uh, excuse me, Mr. Rabbit. No, not now, Bill. I want that little girl to hurry up with my gloves. Not so little. Whatever are you talking about? <laughs> what is she playing at? Up and down like a yo-yo. Get out of my house this instant. She's not coming. She most certainly is not. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. I do need my gloves. Oh, Bill, please remove that thing from my house. What? Go on. Throw her out. Oh, I really am too old for this sort of thing. Throw her out. Oh, I never... Out! You go! Stop it! That tickles! Please stop! <laughs> I do wish you'd stop mucking about, Bill. I need my gloves. Oh, we'll have to... Burn the house down. Yeah. Hmm? Burn my house down? Never. We'll find another way. This ought to do it. Oh, my arthritis. Eggs? I bet if I eat them, something will happen. Dreadful girl, kicking me like that. Glove thief. I know trees are supposed to be big, but oh, either this forest is altogether too big, or I am altogether too small. Alas, I fear it is me. Let me see. I suppose I should eat or drink something. That usually does the trick. You. I hardly know anymore. Explain yourself. I can't explain myself because I'm not myself. I don't see. All I wanted to do was get into the beautiful garden. And here I am, only three inches tall and talking to a blue caterpillar. I am three inches tall? What's so bad about that? Oh, oh nothing, sir. Nothing at all. No offence was intended. It's just that I am the wrong size. Wrong size? Don't be stupid, girl. You are the size you are. I am caterpillar size, and you are little girl size. A little too little, I'm afraid. <laughs> you make no sense. Very well. I'll bid you a good day. Wait. Oh, wait. I have something to tell you. What? I want to tell you what I know about the beautiful garden. Oh, please tell me. I have never heard of it. Oh, thank you very much. Wait, wait. I have something more to tell you. What is it now? The mushroom. What about the mushroom? Eat one side and you will grow taller. 
eat the other side, and you will grow shorter. But which side is which? Now, which one is which? you were a foot fish. Well, you would have been wrong. What should I do with it? Give it to the Duchess. She lives in there. A shed bird baby. Oh, shut up. More pepper. The soap needs some more pepper. <laughs> Salt, but not enough pepper. <laughs> You've done. Be crafty to your little boy and beat him when he sneezes. He only does it to annoy because he knows it teases. I speak severely to my boy. I beat him when he sneezes, for he can thoroughly enjoy the pepper when he pleases. <laughs> must dress for croquet. <laughs> Cheshire Puss, would you please tell me how to get to the beautiful garden? That depends on how much you want to get there. Oh, very much. Very much indeed. Ah, then it doesn't matter which way you go. Whatever do you mean? In that direction lives a hatter. He's quite mad. In that direction lives a March Hare. And he's completely mad. They won't be able to help me if they're mad. Oh. <laughs> they're all mad here. I'm mad. You're mad. He's mad. I am not mad! <laughs> How do you know I'm mad? <laughs> You're here, aren't you? That's true. To Lou. Who knows where the beautiful garden is? The hatter or the hare? That's for you. 
to find out. Really? What a curious cat. Oh, no, no. Not curious. Strange, yes. Mad, yes. But curious? <laughs> Never. Why not? My dear girl, curiosity killed the cat. Curiouser and curiouser. <laughs> shouldn't say what you don't mean. I mean what I say. At least, I say what I mean. Oh, it's all the same. It is not. You might as well say, I like what I get is the same as I get what I like. Or, I see what I eat is the same as I eat what I see. <laughs> you might as well say that I breathe when I sleep is the same as I sleep when I breathe. It is the same with you. Could either of you two gentlemen tell me how to enter the beautiful garden? Oh, perhaps if you tell me what the date is. The fourth. Two days slow. That should fix it. That's no way to treat the time. Huh. If you knew the time as well as I do, you'd know how to treat him. Him? Oh, yes. Time is a him. I dare say you've never even spoken to time. No, but I know how to beat time when I learn music. <laughs> time just hates being beaten. No, if you kept on good terms with time, he'd do almost anything you wanted. <laughs> what sort of anything? Oh, say it was uh, nine o'clock and time for your lessons. You could have a word to time, and there you are. 1.30. Time for lunch. What if I wasn't hungry? Simple. You just stay at 1.30 until you are. <laughs> Is that how you always stay at tea time? Alas, yes. You see, I had a quarrel with time. What happened? I was performing a song for the Queen of Hearts. Twinkle, twinkle, a little bit. How oh, I wonder what you're at. Uh, but perhaps you know it, huh? Up above the world so high, like a tea tree in the sky. Then the queen jumped up and said, Stop it, the time is wrong. You're murdering the time. And, and, and I said, me? Murdering the time? And Mr. Time heard me, and he hasn't worked for me since. Mm, ever since then, it's been six o'clock. <laughs> tea time. Come on! Everybody move up one place! Why did we do that? There's never time to do any dishes, so we have to keep moving around. I see. <laughs> you mentioned you might know how I can reach the beautiful garden. No! Never heard of it. Nor me. I don't know what you're talking about. Stupid girl. I really don't think... Then you shouldn't talk. Really? Good day. More tea? Oh, don't mind if I do. <laughs> oh, delicious. Mad. Utterly mad. I will just have to find my garden on my own. That's curious. The beautiful garden. Oh, just 
Just look at those roses. They almost don't look real. <laughs> Smells more of paint than of rose. It is paint. Hey, club, you just painted a leaf. It was a bug. Anyway, you just painted Diamond's hand. What? Oh, Spade, why did you do that? Me? Club did that. You? Why are you painting the white roses red? Why, miss, there should have been a red rose, but Spade planted a white one by mistake. Me? If the Queen finds out, it's... Off with our heads. <laughs> oh, no, here comes the Queen. Oh, oh quickly, ah, quickly! <laughs> have been painted red. Who is responsible? He is. He is. He is. You all are. Off with their heads. Ouch. <laughs> Who are you? Alice. Your Majesty. Uh, you may let them go. A royal pardon. Philip? Yes, dear. This is Alice. She's joining us for croquet. Ah, how do you do? Come on, let's go. <laughs> Hogs and flamingos. It it makes for a more interesting game. Thank 
truly a game of croquet I have ever played. Shh, 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 shh. Whatever you do, don't beat the queen. Why ever not? Oh, the last one who beat the queen. Oh, off with his head. How disgusting. Why, that queen is such a... Is such a... Such a good croquet player. It's hardly worth playing. Johnny, good shot, my majesty. <laughs> torts, the Queen's torts, anyone? I was still extinct, didn't you? <laughs> he wouldn't know where my garden is. One never knows. I certainly don't know where it is. I'm a dodo. I think I'll go back to the croquet. The mock turtle knows. Who? The mock turtle. I'll take you to him. Very well. Walk this way. There. <gasps> oh, me. <laughs> she wants to get to the beautiful garden. <laughs> oh, what's the point? <laughs> I can't go on. Whatever is the matter? <laughs> Don't ask. What's wrong with him? He's a mock turtle. They're all like that. Why do they call you a mock turtle? <laughs> because... Because I'm not a real turtle. That's my trouble. <laughs> I'm very sorry to hear it. But do you know where my garden is? Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. A long time ago, when I was very little, we had a teacher, an old turtle called Tortoise. If he was a turtle, why did you call him Tortoise? Because he taught us. Silly girl. Yeah, real dodo. <laughs> Old tortoise. Tortoise reeling and writhing. And the garden. What about the garden? Oh, and mystery. Ancient and modern mystery. The garden? And seography. Lots of seography. Please, sir. I would like to find the beautiful garden. Oh, all right. I'll tell you where it is. Tell her. Tell her. Well, you walk over there. The trial's beginning. The trial's beginning. The trial's beginning. A trial. Oh, I do like a trial. Come on. What about my garden? What garden? There's a trial on. Woohoo! <laughs> Herald, 
Bring him the prisoner. <laughs> first. Then off with his head. Please read the charges. Please read the charges. I read the charges. Please read the charges. The charges. The Queen of Hearts, she made some tarts, all on a summer's day. The Knave of Hearts, he stole the tarts and took them quite away. <laughs> <laughs> Consider your verdict. Guilty! 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 Off with his head! Wait, wait! We must show the evidence. Uh, uh, bring on the evidence. Bring on the evidence! Bring on the evidence! Bring on the evidence! <laughs> Ray of tarts with two missing. S -s Stolen? Off with his head! Excuse me? Silence in court! Silence! 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 What? Ah. What? 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 I ate the tongue. Ah. Oh, I was stole my tea. And my cake. I did not. She nearly drowned me. And me. Oh, my chimney. But and she kidnapped my pig, oh, baby. She uh, kicked me through the air. She's guilty. Uh, arrest her. Thank you. 